Hi Capricorn, welcome back to Angel Love 333. Hope everybody's doing great. We're going to do your almost personal reading here in a moment. Just a few things uh, in the description box I want to mention. If you want to enter my personal reading giveaway, details are below. Also, how to contact me for a personal reading. And also, uh, my Meditation Relax Calm channel if you want to check it out. So with that, Capricorn, let's just get started with your reading. We're going to get some hidden truths here from your person. So what are the hidden truths from Capricorn's person? Okay. Ew. I want to be more than friends. Okay. Interesting. So this could be someone who's been keeping things casual, or this could be someone around you who is a friend. I wonder if you are happy without me. You don't know how hard it was to let you go, okay? So even if it's a friendship, I'm picking up that this could be a situation where they saw you like in another connection or relationship, and that was very hard for them to see. And some of you, this could be somebody that kept things casual, and maybe um, it didn't really go to the next level. And then you have here, um, I want to feel that way again. So let's see what your tarot says. We're going to uh, do what they're thinking, feeling about you, their upcoming actions, their intentions. We'll get the potential outcome, and then we'll get some love notes. So what is this person thinking or feeling here for Capricorn? What is this person thinking or feeling for Capricorn? Okay, we got the star card, strong Aquarius energy. We have the king of pentacles. We have, oh, look at that. We have a couple, the queen of pentacles. And they're looking at each other too, <laughs> okay? Uh, and the three of cups, wow. And bottom of the deck here, we have the temperance. We have strong Sagittarius energy. So I feel like this is someone, um, just as it says here, um, I want to be more than friends. I want to feel that way again. I feel like you got someone who's looking at you as a partner. Uh, even relationship material here. You got the star card here as well. Now there may be some healing, you know, depending on your situation. This is someone who's want, who wants to reconnect with you. Somebody I see here who wants to communicate. Uh, some of you, this could be a reconciliation. Wow. And like I said, it could be uh, Sagittarius energy, Aquarius energy, uh, could or could be another Earth sign, a Capricorn, a Taurus, or a Virgo. Let's see what their upcoming actions are towards you, Capricorn. What's this person's upcoming actions towards Capricorn? Okay, we got the Six of Pentacles. We have the Emperor. We have the Knight of Swords. And we have the Nine of Cups. Okay, and we have the King of Swords. Or, I'm sorry, the Queen of Swords. So, Capricorn, what I'm getting here is I feel like you have someone where it feels like this is someone where... Things were unbalanced between you and this person. So either it was a friendship or it was a casual relationship, but it definitely feels like someone here was not giving their all in the connection or the relationship. I feel possibly it could be this person here, um, Aries energy, uh, possibly for some of you. And I feel like you could be, this, this could be somebody who works a lot. I feel like there, you could be dealing with someone who works a lot or you work a lot. Someone works a lot here in the situation and they may have been giving more focus and time to their work or to something else. And it feels like it was, was not balanced energy. Okay. And it may be right. If this is someone who's around you, who is a friend and you would know that it could be, they watched you, right? you know, in another connection or another relationship. Take it how it resonates. But you have the Knight of Swords here and you have the Nine of Cups. 
This is someone I feel they're coming towards you, definitely coming towards you with communication. I feel like they they want to give to this connection or relationship. Now they may see you as guarded with this Queen of Swords energy. They may see you as guarded, but I feel like they're hoping that you're going to be open to communication with them. I feel like this could be someone too who may ask you out on a date or um, depending when you watch this video because I am filming it really close to New Year's. They could even ask you to go somewhere with them for New Year's to celebrate. I'm getting that energy as well. Okay, so let's see uh, what their intentions are coming towards you. What's this person's intentions coming towards Capricorn? I feel like this is someone too you're really compatible with or the two of you may have like kind of the same um, career goals or you both are uh, very hard workers but let's see um, what's this person's intentions coming towards Capricorn okay we have the chariot strong cancerian energy we have uh, Scorpio energy uh, death rebirth card we have the fool card and we have judgment. Okay, second chances here. Some of you, this is someone either it never took off in the past or there was an ending between you and this person. And I see the intention here is to come towards you. This person wants a chance at this love. Um, we've got the seven of pentacles showing me they want to invest in this connection. Okay. So I feel there's good intentions here. This may be somebody too, who, who actually is realizing maybe they had their focus, um, elsewhere and it should have been on you. So let's see what the love notes are. Actually, this turned out really nicely, uh, Capricorn, because some of your past readings have not been as nice. <laughs> okay. Let's see here, what love notes do we have from Capricorn's person? Okay, I wish things were different between us. Yeah, they want more. It's right there with, I want to be more than friends. Or I want something more than something casual. Please don't hate me for ghosting you. You didn't deserve it. So this, this could be someone who wasn't uh, supportive. Maybe they didn't answer your messages or... Uh, they kind of disappeared for a while. I get scared when I'm being honest with you. Okay, interesting. So this could be someone who has a hard time being vulnerable, but look, the fool card's there, so they want to take that risk, that leap of faith. And I see my future when I look into your eyes. All right. All right, Capricorn, I hope that this reading helped you. I hope you all have a wonderful rest of the day or evening, and I'm sending you angel love.